Hey guys, today I'm making this little log cabin for the pets. Always ask a parent for help before starting any craft. And for this project, you'll need Okay, so let's get started. First, glue your paper straws together for the side pieces for your cabin. If you don't have paper straws, you can create your own, although this does take some time, by rolling paper around a dowel. And just be sure to pull your dowel out before it gets trapped. And make sure that you glue it early on so that when you cut it, the pieces will not unravel. straws like these, which are a little bit thinner than the ones I'll be using, you'll probably want to stack about 12 to 15 for each side. So cut to size, trim the ends, glue together, and when completely dry, you can paint. And a fast way to do that is to use spray paint if you have it. I cut all of my straws to seven and a half inches, and then I cut my pieces so that I'll have a window closer to the front, leaving enough room to put one of my little bunk beds. So as you can see, my wall is going to be about four and a half inches tall, maybe then glue your pieces together and do the exact same thing for your opposite wall. Next, I cut out pieces of cardboard for my back and my base. My base is the same width and as long as my walls. When your wall has dried, line it up with your back wall and mark where they meet. Draw a line across, measure and mark at the halfway point. Draw a straight line from this point to the next and then cut. And here, instead of wrapping my pieces in paper, I'm going to paint them white and make lines so that they match the theme of my straws. And now I can glue. Then I cut out a long strip of my white craft foam paper to fit along the top. Fold it in half and score. And I continue my theme by making black marks. I trim any extra overhang. And if you like, you can score lines for detail. then glue. I then glue two pieces of packaging material together and paint the visible side. And then I glue. Place my pet inside and figure out where to glue my next bunk. I cut out craft foam paper for easy mattresses and then I fold over and glue a piece of felt for my pillow. And glue two popsicle sticks for steps. Then I cut out and glue two popsicle sticks to a bit of thin cardboard and glue. And I can slide under a little chair just two popsicle sticks and some beads. And then I add some pencils and pens and a little book, highlights, or a little journal. And if you like, you can add some sleeping bags made from a previous tutorial, and you are good to go. Well, guys, I sure hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Hey, guys. And today, special shout out school and two Lily Bananas, LPS Haley, LPS Teha, Trinity Bivlock. Farah World, Lizette Vasquez, LPS Haley, but spelled differently, y'all, and Amaya Brooklyn. Go check them out, y'all. Thanks, guys.